Hey there all craft cider lovers. Yeah, it's time for another cider review. And yeah, I'm really excited for this one because we are going to Normandy in France. And we're taking a look at this fella. It's a uh, Poire Authentique. I believe I may be mispronouncing that and I do apologize to all you lovely people in France. Uh, from Eric Bordelais. Poire Authentique. Authentic or Poire Authentic uh, Genuine Pear Cider coming in at a lovely 5% in this lovely 750 milliliter bottle. A uh, dark green color, very, very traditional looking, lovely label. It's got a nice uh, dark wooden cork, the, the bird cage and everything there. So let me tell you a little bit about it, guys, as I'm Work, working my way through the bottle, opening it. So, Eric Bordelais, uh, so he is actually, uh, he was, uh, well he is, he's still, he's still alive of course, he was a uh, winemaker, a wine sommelier in Paris actually, worked for many years at a uh, Guide Michelin restaurant. There we go. But he wanted to go back to his home roots. There we go. Good pop. Lot of, lot of smoke. Let's go. Get, get this one popped up. And, so yeah. Gonna use the little nice looking wine glass for this one. In honor of Eric Bordelais. Why? Because I'm gonna tell you about it. There we go. Because Eric Bordelais worked as a uh, wine sommelier at a... Uh, three-star Guide Michelin restaurant in Paris. But he wanted to go back to his roots, basically, to Normandy, where he was born and raised, to go into the cider business. And that he did. He, he purchased a big estate and started to grow both apples and cider apples and cider pears. Uh, and uh, ever since he did that, this, his kind of enterprise has been a success story. So I'm right, really excited to try out this one. Poiré Authentique by Eric Bordelais. Uh, there we go. Look at that. Look at that, guys. So we've got a lovely, lovely pale golden color. Good deal of carbonation. A lot of... Look at that. Look at that as I turn the glass a little bit. You can see the lightning effects there. Really, really, really good. You can hear the carbonation hissing and fizzing. I'm excited because Eric Bordelais is a big name in the cider business, in the cider, craft cider industry. Let's get the aroma. Oh, it smells absolutely marvelous. Jammy pears. Vanilla. Little bit of a minerally touch. Oh, boiled jammy pears with a little touch of vanilla. Oh my goodness me, that smells so good. So with that said, guys, let's dive in, see what we're going to get. Cheers, all. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Oh, yeah. And the smell is exactly the same thing as the uh, taste. You get jammy pears. Jammy, jammy boiled pears. With a mix of slight vanilla into that mix. Lurking about there. Providing a little bit of a lovely sweetness to it. What a lovely cider. Again... Mm. Mm. Oh, slight touch of vinegar, a little bit of a wine-like uh, acidity as well, lurking about. So it's quite, quite a complex one, quite a complex pear cider actually. It's it's got initial sweetness, vanilla sweetness, and jammy pear sweetness. And then you, afterwards you get that kind of lovely acidic touch to it. At the same time it's spritzy, 
It's got a good spritzy body to it, good carbonation. A little bit of a back, dry back end to it as well. What a lovely cider, guys. For all you cider lovers out there, and I know you are many people out there, there's a lot of you, uh, this is definitely a one to try out. Final sip. Mmm. 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 Oh yeah, here comes even more things here. So there's almost like a, like a cinnamony, spicy thing there at the back end. Slight, lovely, sweet initial vanilla notes, jammy pears, touch of sweetness, then it moves over into that kind of lovely acidic, spicy vibe with a touch of cinnamon and that's interesting very very interesting guys uh complexity galore really really interesting cider uh poire authentique by eric bordelais there hope you can there we go eric bordelais down there on the label poire authentique authentic pear cider from normandy guys from france this is a uh, must try if you are a craft cider fan, if you can ever get hold of this one, do it, buy it, try it, drink it, enjoy it, guys. For me, it's a lovely, lovely cider. Uh, I'm looking forward to more uh, products from Eric Bordelais, uh, a man who actually invested a lot of things going from the wine business, taking his knowledge of wines into the cider business and uh, going forward into that. Very, very exciting. Very, very interesting. For me, it's a lovely 4 out of 5. Thank you for watching.